بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ولكم افروان مع حضراتكم اسماء جمال مائد وقسم التمريض البطني والجراحي اي ويل توك اباوت ليكشر انتايتلت كوفيد 19 ديزيز اندر سوبرفيشن بروفيسور دكتور اماني شبل اوتلاينز اوبجيكتيفز انتروداكشن وات از كورونا فيروس ديفينيشن اوف الكوفيد 19 ديزيز ريسك اوف الاكسبوشر فور كوفيد 19 ديزيز Symptoms of the COVID-19 disease, mode of transmission of the COVID-19, what are your chances of developing COVID-19, treatment of the COVID-19, basic protective measure against the new coronavirus. Two days statistic. Objectives, general objectives. By the end of this lecture, our colleagues will be able to demonstrate the COVID-19 disease, specific objectives, define coronavirus. Define COVID-19 disease, analyze the risk of exposure for COVID-19 disease, discuss symptoms of COVID-19 disease, analyze the mode of transmission of COVID-19 disease, evaluate your chances of developing COVID-19 disease, apply basic protective measures against the new coronavirus. Introduction These two days, coronavirus is often prefaced with the word novel because it is precisely what is a new strain in a family of viruses will have all seen before and in some form had. According to WHO, coronavirus are a large family of viruses that range from the common cold to much more serious disease. This disease can affect both humans and animals. The strain that began spread in Wuhan, the capital of China's Hobi province, is related to two other coronavirus that have caused major outbreaks in recent years, severe acute respiratory syndrome, SARS, and Middle East respiratory syndrome, MARS. What about coronavirus? Coronaviruses are a large group of viruses that may cause disease in animals and humans. It's known that a number of coronaviruses cause human respiratory infections that range from common colds to more severe disease, such as MARS, Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, and SARS, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome. The newly discovered coronavirus causes the COVID-19 virus. Definition of COVID-19 disease COVID-19 disease is an infectious disease caused by the newly discovered coronavirus. There was no knowledge of this virus and this emerging disease before the outbreak in China's city of Wuhan in December 2019. Risk of exposure for COVID-19 disease The immediate risk of being exposed to this virus is still low for most Americans, but as the outbreak expands, that risk will increase. Cases of COVID-19 and instances of the community spread are being reported in a growing number of states. People in places where ongoing community spread of the virus that causes COVID-19 has been reported are at elevated risk of exposure, with the level of risk dependent on location. Healthy care workers caring for patients with COVID-19 are at elevated risk of exposure. Close contacts of persons with COVID-19 also are at elevated risk of exposure. Travelers returning from affected international locations where communities spread in occurring also are at elevated risk of exposure, with level of risk dependent on where they traveled. Risk of severe illnesses Early information out of China where COVID-19 first started shows that some people are at higher risk of getting very sick from these illnesses. This includes older adults with risk increasing by age, people who have serious chronic medical conditions like heart disease, diabetes, lung disease. Symptoms of COVID-19 disease Common symptoms of COVID-19 disease are fever, fatigue, and dry cough. Some patients may experience pain and aches, nasal condition called sustras or diarrhea. These symptoms are usually mild and begin gradually. Some people become infected without showing any symptoms and without feeling ill. 
Can a person get sick by asymptomatic? The main method of transmission of the disease is the respiratory droplets that a person secretes when coughing. The risk of COVID-19 disease is diminished by someone asymptomatic, but many people with the disease have only slight symptoms. This is especially true in the early stage of a disease. Therefore, COVID-19 can be infected by a person who suffers from a mild cough and doesn't feel ill. Mode of transmission of COVID-19 disease People can become infected with COVID-19 disease by other people who have the virus. The disease can be transmitted from person to person through small droplets scattered from the nose or mouth when a person with COVID-19 disease cough or sneeze. These droplets fall on the object and surface surrounding the person. Other people can then develop COVID-19 disease when they come into contact with this object or surface and then touch their eyes, nose, or mouth. People can also get COVID-19 disease if they breathe droplets that come out the person with the disease with a cough or exhaling. WHO is assessing ongoing research on ways to spread COVID-19 disease and will continue to publish its most recent findings. Can the virus causing COVID-19 be transmitted through the air? Studies carried out to date indicated the virus that causes COVID-19 disease is transmitted primarily through contact with respiratory droplets rather than through the air. What are your chances of developing COVID-19 disease? The danger depends on where you are and more specifically whether COVID-19 infection is spreading there. For most people in most places, the risk of developing COVID-19 infection remains low. However, there are some places in the world that the disease is currently spreading. The risk of developing COVID-19 infection is higher for people who live in or visit these areas. Governments and health authorities are now taking strict measures whenever a new case of COVID-19 is revealed. Cooperation with the agents concerned with disease control would reduce the risk and spread of COVID-19 disease. Treatment of COVID-19 disease Not yet to death, there is no vaccine and no specific antiviral medicine to prevent or treat COVID-19. However, those affected should receive care to relieve symptoms. People with serious illness should be hospitalized. Most patients recover thanks to supportive care. Basic protective measures against the new coronavirus. Stay aware of the latest information on the COVID-19 outbreak, available on the WHO website and through your national and local public health authority. Most people who become infected experience mild illness and recover, but it can be more serious for others. Take care of your health and protect others by doing the following. Number one, wash your hand frequently, regularly. Clean your hand with alcohol-based hand rubber or wash them with soap and water. Number two, maintain social distancing. Maintain at least one meter distance between yourself and anyone who is coughing or sneezing. Number three, avoid touching your eye nose and mouth. Why? Hands touch many surfaces and they can pick up viruses. Once contaminated, the virus can enter your body and they can make you sick. Number four, practice respiratory hygiene. This means covering your mouth and nose with your bent elbow or tissue when you cough or sneeze. Then dispose of used tissue immediately. If you have fever, cough and difficulty breathing, seek medical care early. Stay home if you feel unwell. If you have a fever, cough, and difficulty breathing, seek medical attention and call in advance. Follow the direction of your local health authority. Stay informed and follow the advice given by your health care provider. Stay informed on the latest developments about COVID-19. Follow advice given by your health care provider, your national and local public health authority, or your employer on how to protect yourself and others from COVID-19.
protection measures for persons who are in or have recently visited past 14 days areas to where COVID-19 is spreading. Number one, follow the guidance outlined above. Number two, stay at home if you begin to feel unwell, even with mild symptoms such as headache and slight runny nose until you recover. Number three, if you develop fever, cough, and difficulty breathing, seek medical advice properly, call in advance, and tell your provider of any recent travel or contact with travelers. General Public Health Information Help stop coronavirus. Those are five. Number one, hands. Wash them often. Number two, elbow. Cough into it. Number three, face. Don't touch it. Number four, fit. Stay more than one meter apart. Number five, feel sick. Stay home. This table demonstrates today's statistic about coronavirus. Egypt, confirmed cases, 850. Recovered cases, 159. This is 52. Thank you.